Hey. Hello friends. Welcome to Tech Accessibility Tutorials. This is Vaishnavi here. So friends, if you want my latest updates and videos, just click on subscribe button. Then you will get all my latest updates and videos to your email directly. So friends, thanks for subscribing my YouTube channel. Now we have direct link to your YouTube channel. Go and type www.youtube.com slash tech accessibility tutorials. I will also give the link in the description as well. So friends, in this video, I'm going to show you how to portable non-visual desktop access. So it's a popular screen reader as we all know. So let's learn how to portable it. So before porting it, we need to create a new folder in our computer or laptop in any drive. So I'm going to press Windows M to go to the desktop. Okay, now I'm on the desktop. Now I'm going to press T to go to this PC. T. Google this PC two of sixteen. Okay. This PC. Now I'm gonna press any drive. S. Three. Okay. After selecting the drive, press enter. Now here we have to press applications key. Context menu. After pressing applications key, we have to press W to go to new sub menu. Folder F. After pressing W, we have to press enter on the folder option shortcut folder f folder f so we can press f or we can just press enter on it f study p now we have to name this folder so let's type portable here for example p o r t a b l e so after typing it we have to press enter portable 18 of 18 the folder has been created now i'm going to press alt f4 to close this window so now I'm on the desktop. Now let's press NVDA key plus N. NVDA key N. Okay. That is insert N or caps lock N according to your preferences. So I'm going to press here insert plus N. NVDA menu. So after pressing NVDA menu has opened. Now I'm going to press down arrow twice to go to tools submenu. Preferences submenu P. Tools submenu T. Okay. After getting tools submenu, we have to press right arrow to expand the list. I'm going to press right arrow here. View log V. Okay. After pressing right arrow, we have to press down arrow until we hear create portable copy C. So I'm going to press down arrow here. Speech view the rest. Python console P. Manage add-ons A. Create portable copy C. Yes, create portable copy. We have to press enter on it. Ma create portable copy C. Okay, I'm gonna press enter. Create portable NVDA dialog to create a portable copy of NVDA. Please select the path and other options and then press continue. Portable directory, grouping, portable directory, edit all. Now we have to press tab. Browse button. I'm going to press tab again after the browse button. Copy current user configuration checkbox not checked alt plus u. Copy current user configuration checkbox not checked. We have to check this checkbox to copy our current user configuration settings. If we uncheck this checkbox, all the add-ons which we have downloaded will not be copied to our portable copy. So I'm going to press check this checkbox. I'm going to press space bar here. Space checked. Okay. I'm gonna press now shift tab to go to browse button. Portable directory grouping browse copy color portable directory grouping browse button. Okay, now I'm on the browse button. I'm gonna press enter on it. Browse for folder dialog. Now we have to select a folder that we have created for this portable NVDA. Cancel select portable directory tree. Here we have to select the drive and go to the folder which we have created now. Study. So I'm gonna select the drive. Expand, collab, expanded, 15. P, level 3, portable 14 on 15. Okay, I have to select the drive and I'm gonna select the folder here. My portable 14 on 15, level 3. So after getting portable folder, we have to press enter on it. Create portable NVDA. Now we're gonna press continue button after pressing enter on the portable folder browse but copy current user configuration checkbox checked alt plus u i'm pressing tab until we hear continue button 
Continue button Alt plus C. Okay, continue button. We're gonna press enter here. Creating portable success dialog successfully created a portable copy of NVDA at the portable OK button. So the copy has been created successfully. So we're gonna press OK button here. Now the portable copy has been created. We have to copy this portable copy to our pen drive or memory stick or anywhere else. So I'm gonna press Windows M. Pain. So now we have to go to the drive in which we have copied the portable copy T Google this PC 2 of 6 Okay This PC Now I'm gonna select the drive S 3 I have selected the drive and yes we have to select here the folder P portable 14 of 18 Yes portable We have to copy this folder Control plus C I have pressed Control C to copy this folder I'm gonna press backspace. Three. I have already connected my Item. pen drive here, so I have to paste this folder in the pen drive. Libraries. This PC row two column. Three. T. Devices and drives grouping expanded. Tech access H. Row the two column. The pen drive name is Tech Access. So I'm gonna press enter on this pen drive's name. TV. Tech access H. Three. Okay. Now we have to press Control V. To paste the folder which we have copied control plus v that is control v four percent complete copying one thousand two the folder is getting pasted here as you hear the percentage and the sound beep also yes it's getting copied so our direct link of our youtube channel is www.youtube.com slash t-e-c-h-a-c-c-e-s-s-i-b-i-l-i-t-y-t-u-t-o-r-i-a-l-s so if you type this address bar in address bar you will be redirect to our youtube channel directly so you can watch all the videos which we have uploaded there so it's getting copied Yes. Tech export. Yes, the copy process has been completed successfully. Now let's stop NVDA, exit NVDA, and close this window as well. Obstructed. Okay. Now I'm gonna press Windows M to go to Pain. desktop first, and. I'm gonna press insert Q to stop NVDA. Exit NVDA dialog. Restart. Exit. So I'm gonna press enter on exit. Now we're gonna press Windows Enter to start the narrator. That is Windows key plus enter. Nar narrator dialog. No button. Unchecked. Don't ask again. Yes button. So I'm gonna press. S button to start the narrator. Enter. So I have pressed S and enter. Now I have connected my pen drive and then NVDA has been stopped. So let's check how we can start portable copy here. So first of all we go to Windows R to go to run. Win run dialog. So I have pressed Windows R to open the run dialog box here we have to type h colon because uh, the pen drive drive is on h so we have to press h h colon shift h colon backslash selection delete left end of line okay I have num to open h h editable escape Window run dialog H colon H colon backslash backslash portable. We have to type the folder name here. What we have created, so I have created portable here. So I'm gonna press portable. I mean, type portable P O R T A B L E backslash portable backslash H colon backslash portable backslash 
Now we have to type nvda.exe. N V D A H colon backslash portable backslash nvda full stop E X E. Okay, I have typed H colon backslash portable backslash nvda dot exe. We have to type the drive of the pen drive and after giving colon and black slash we have to type the folder name and after giving backslash again we have to type nvda.exe okay i'm gonna press enter on this hey, windows Welcome, Welcome to NVDA, NVDA dialog. Checked to use caps NVDA lock as an NVDA modifier. Yes, the NVDA has been started now. So let's stop narrator first. Absolutely. Task Very narrator set so escape. Welcome Exiting to NVDA narrator. Welcome to NVDA. So the narrator has been stopped. Shut okay button. Up. So, so the NVDA has been started. So friends, in this way, you can use portable nvda in anyone's computer or laptop it will be useful very useful when you are in job interviews or when you go to any net center or when you want to use nvda in any other's laptop or it will be very useful so friends if you like this video give it a thumbs up and click on like button so if you like this video keep sharing with your friends on twitter google plus whatsapp and facebook thanks for watching this video Absolutely. Absolutely. Settings button. Stop recording button.